Hello, I got a request on a video for using PHP API to connect with RabbitMQ. I don't work with PHP, but I decided to make a video anyway and hope that it will be helpful. Okay, let's get started. Uh, I will be using PHP AMQP library client. This library is PHP implementation for AMQP091 protocol. So I've created a folder where I will have all my files related to this project. So the first we, we need to create composer.json file and add here the library that we will be using. There, there is another way, I think you can just run the command um, composer require and this library and it will be installed also. All dependencies probably will install the latest version. But the way I did it, I did it through this composer.json file. After that, we will we need to make sure that Composer is installed. So for that, I just went to this uh, Composer website and here on the download page, download Composer, they have the bunch of um, commands like script. I just copied it and navigated to the folder for my project and just run all these commands and it was installed composer locally I think like there are different ways I just installed it uh, locally here to my project files, uh, my project folder. And after that, um, you just run this command php, php composer dot phar slash install. And it will install all dependence on um, this vendor folder and all dependencies and libraries there. So after that, uh, I created two files, received that PHP and sent that PHP. So for sending messages and receiving messages, first let's look at send. And they both very similar. So for send, the first we will edit this uh, library here, first line. And then we say and use some classes for connection and message. Then we create a connection with this new class constructor and pass in here uh, localhost address port password username username password since it's locally to localhost otherwise it will be the address with rabbit and key running okay we created connection next we create in channel here and declare Q on this channel with declare uh, Q declare and pass in Q name uh, wanted to change this Q name let's do it P H P Q and some other parameters I don't remember all of them what means there are some durable and some other things 
you can just check this um, library documentation on github to see what does it mean but the important thing is just uh, declare a queue name here and after that we create a message and passing this message to the publish method on the channel the basic publish method passing message and here is q name so we need to pass q name and again for this parameter don't remember it's not important in the in my case but you can look up what does it mean and after that we send that message was sent and then we close first channel and then we close connection and for receive it's very similar adding library using class connection the same channel the same we declaring queue we declaring queue in both in, in receive php and send php in case depending on what is running first it will create queue Otherwise, for receive, it will create queue. If there is no queue and it waiting for the message, it will break, I guess, I think. So we just creating queue in case if it wasn't created yet. And then we just printing some that we waiting for message. Then we creating callback. And, pop, um, and printing the message body to the console once it's received. And this call, callback we will pass later, as you see, to consume function. So here we consuming from the queue. Change it to, to PHP queue, and there are some parameters. I think this true is for hmm, probably if the server started that. Uh, exist or messages I, I honestly don't remember all these parameters need to look them up but the book important thing is Q name and callback here so I'm consume callback and callback function we defined earlier we will print to the screen message And next we say while is consuming, we waiting. Otherwise it will close the channel and close connection. So let's save everything. And now I have terminal opens opened and I do first let's look at my rabbit in queue management UI I do not have any queues and I go back and run php uh, send that php okay so uh, send hello world and go back and I have PHP queue with one message here 
probably too small. Let's do it bigger. So let's look at the message. Yes, this message is there. And now I can run. Oops. Actually, run from different terminal window. So for receive. Says waiting for message, so received message and printed it. Yes, cancel and if I go back, there is no messages. So and this concludes my short demo. Uh, thanks for watching. Leave me comments and maybe other requests, and see you in my next video.